No. WFXR Sports. Ah, uh, yes. Good evening, everyone. I'm Jermaine Farrell. Hoping your day is wonderful and blessed. Time now for the latest in sports news, where the Virginia Tech football team spring practice is in full spring with their spring game coming up a week from Saturday. And for senior wide receiver Ali Jennings, his football career at the college and high school levels has had a few stops. He played at a pair of high schools in Richmond area. Then at the college level, he spent two seasons at West Virginia, then last season at Old Dominion. But through it all, one school was on his brain. It was Virginia Tech. And that is where he wants to be, and he's happy to be a Hokie. It kind of disappointed me. Uh, growing up, being a Virginia guy, you, I would always come to Virginia Tech games, uh, more so Virginia Tech than UVA, um, because uh, a lot of guys from Richmond mainly went to Tech uh, as I was growing up. So that was like a big thing that I was looking forward to. Uh, but me not getting an offer kind of put a chip on my shoulder. Um, I did have a few other offers that were on the same level. But uh, I was always in the hunt for uh, those two schools that I never got. Um, but uh, I mean, it came full circle at the end. Jennings made the most of his opportunity at another Commonwealth school in Old Dominion University in Norfolk. There he led the team in receptions, yards, and touchdowns. And he looks to use the experience and everything he gained from Old Dominion to transfer it to the young receiving group at Virginia Tech. I feel like, first off, my leader, my verbal leadership has gotten better. Um, just helping the younger guys come a long way. I know my room specifically uh, is really young. Um, just so teaching them vet moves, vet things to know when they're out there playing so they can play full speed. Now during Allie Jennings' college football career, he's had to deal with some injuries, especially last season at Old Dominion. But he looks at this opportunity at the Virginia Tech as a rebirth to make a comeback and get back on the football field and be productive for the Hokies. I didn't, I didn't hold any hard feelings versus the coaches. I know these coaches weren't here. Uh, when I was in the recruiting process, but uh, I just I just felt like I had unfinished business. Uh, I, my mom always told me we aren't quitters, we finish what we start, and uh, I didn't get to finish last year, so I intend to finish what I started last year this uh, this upcoming season 